Hi, welcome to Civil Connection Channel. Now we are going to see about uh, AutoCAD, that is mass properties. How we are going to define a mass property for, of an uh, object in AutoCAD. Okay, uh, so here there are three commands can be used. One it is list, L-I-S-T, list. Another it is area, A-R-E-A, -E area. And third it is mass properties. Uh, so M-A-S-S-P-R-O-P. This is the three commands we are going to use here. Uh, so here, we shall see in the AutoCAD uh, that is uh, the commands can be drawn. So before that I shall draw the uh, rectangle or some uh, uh, object. So I shall draw a rectangle. So before drawing I shall draw first uh, line commands. How we are going to choose it. So line command I shall use line command and uh, draw a closed object. Okay. Have drawn a rectangle uh, using line commands. Uh, for this, I can directly draw this, uh, draw the, uh, uh, get the uh, area using area command A R E A area. So I am using the area command. See here, uh, that is you can choose the object. Object means you can if a rectangle, it is an object. Uh, so if you region that four lines combined four lines will be forming a rectangle. Uh, so you can that is is a single object. You can directly select that object. It will be getting the area. Then other it is a add area, another it is subtract area. Add area means uh, you will be having uh, two area at uh, some different places. So you can directly add the areas. So that is one, you can choose an area in one place and then uh, you can add the other area in other place. Okay, that is second command. And the third it is subtract area. What is meant by subtract area? If you, if you are drawing, having a hollow structure, you will be choosing the whole object will be choosing the whole object okay this is a whole object if you are having a hollow then you need to select if you use subtract area and then you need to uh, subtract the remaining area which is found inside okay that is uh, subtract area now we can use add area or object or uh, you can use uh, sorry add add area so i shall use add area because it is not an object so okay that is I shall choose all the boundaries. You need to choose all the boundaries here. So after that, I shall I have chosen uh, the area that is uh, area of this rectangle. It is uh, just one nine nine one point six zero two nine. This is one type of you are using this area command and you have found the area and perimeter is one eighty one point four one six four. Okay, I shall complete it again. I shall press the enter and I shall uh, complete it. Then again you can use a list command, you need to use list command so that you need to convert this rectangle into that is line, four lines into a rectangle, there is single object. So I shall use the region command R-E-G-I-O-N, this region command uh, and I have choose this objects, enter. So this formed into a single object, okay. Now I shall use the list command L-I-S-T, list command or you can use uh, list directly okay so li i shall choose uh, type it and i can choose this object and find the area or you can choose the object and use the command i uh, first i have used uh, by choosing uh, first i have choose the object then i have written the command okay the same area and perimeter will be available this already we have seen that is 191 uh, sorry 1999 sorry 1991 point 60 uh, mm square and perimeter 181 okay the same and the third command we shall see this mass properties mass properties okay i have chosen the object the same area and perimeter but here you can see this in mass properties that is moment of inertia product of inertia then radius of gyration, then principal moment of inertia. These are all the mass properties and few more mass properties are there. So here in this uh, uh, AutoCAD, you can get this, uh, that is centroid, you can get the centroid, moment of inertia, product of inertia, everything you can get. So how we are going to calculate this for an uh, object? When I shall compare this with an uh, book, the book problem. I shall take a problem in a... Uh, um, Strength of Materials book, that is author R.K. Bansal, 
problem number 5.18 it seems uh, so i shall take this problem and i shall analyze it this is the problem uh, here uh, z section it is a unsymmetrical z section uh, here it is outer dimension it is 40 uh, then here it is 50 then that is 30 okay this is a, a unsymmetrical uh, z section i shall draw this and we shall calculate whether it is the mass properties which is attained in this book and uh, what we are drawing will be achieved okay so i shall find it so i shall erase this and draw the z section 40 50 30 10 mm thickness then 40 then 50 and then 30 10 okay i have drawn this z section now i shall region it if the objects uh, doesn't connect that it, it forms a closed section if it doesn't form a closed structure closed structure it will not, uh, we cannot region it okay so now i shall create the other uh, as uh, mass properties and uh, so i need to cal correct uh, calculate the accurate value so that i shall uh, this is a uh, centroid value the centroid in order to calculate the uh, principal moment uh, we need to place the section in the origin okay so i shall place this object in the origin so we may get the accurate value so i shall first copy this uh, centroid section centroid of x value okay now i shall press now i shall move this object it is in positive x direction so i need to move in the negative x direction so i shall move here the value it is 16 so i have entered now i shall change uh, check the mass properties whether i have moved correctly or not so the value it is 0 now we have to check in the z uh, sorry y direction y direction it is positive di it is in positive so i shall move in the negative direction in y direction so i shall use move command i shall paste the values now the value will be uh, now the section will be in center Now calculate the mass properties. See here, we'll be getting the accurate value. Uh, the area will be one two zero zero perimeter. It is uh, two six zero zero. And this uh, uh, bounding box. What is meant by bounding box? It is the extreme extreme x value uh, in uh, negative direction and then positive direction. Similarly in y, extreme negative and extreme positive okay centroid it is 0 0 so the moment of inertia value it is accurate value that is 29 into 10 power 4 and uh, uh, moment of inertia uh, also it is 56 into 10 power 4 and product of inertia 30 into 10 power 4 and we will be getting the principal moment of axis principal moment moments uh, that is in uh, x direction it is 9.6 into 10 power 4 and in uh, y direction that is minimum maximum so minimum value 9.6 into 10 power 4 maximum value 75.39 into 10 power 4 these are the uh, moment of inertia so this is the easiest way so uh, i have missed uh, one thing so i shall explain this here that is area command area command for hollow section i shall choose that okay uh, now i shall draw a rectangle So with dimensions, it is uh, 10 comma 10. I shall choose it as 10 comma 20. Okay. It is a rectangle. Uh, so for uh, I shall offset it through 2 mm. Okay. Now I have formed a uh, hollow section. So now I shall. 
first uh, uh, use the area command so area command area so first i shall choose the subtract area okay add area instead of add area i shall use the subtract area that is inside values i shall choose this four boundaries okay i have subtracted now i need to add area if you use add area uh, after adding you can use the uh, subtract area will be shown here you can subtract it okay now add area so here i shall add this okay so the area will be 200 and perimeter it is 60 mm okay uh, so there is uh, sorry total area it is 104 mm square that is the uh, area for both addition and subtraction after completing both so 104 you can remember it okay now we shall go for other uh, method uh, here we shall region it okay it forms two uh, loops now i shall subtract the inner value using subtract command that is first i shall choose first object outer object and now it is inner so now i shall uh, use the command area and there is an uh, uh, option object so i shall choose this and directly i choose the, the area it is 104 already we have seen in the uh, add and subtract that is same area 104 okay now you can use list command the same select object same area 104 so this is the uh, mass properties uh, uh, how to define mass properties if you like this video you can uh, use the thumbs up button uh, then if you uh, haven't subscribed this uh, channel please subscribe it share with your friends to share the knowledge between you thank you